Camp in Rome has a long history of providing outdoor experiences for children and adults with disabilities, but they need help to do that. That's right. TV5 is partnering with the camp for a telethon this evening. Tom Krasnowski is in Manchester and joins us now with more. Hey, Tom. Hey there, Brittany. John, let's share a camp story. Right here is Scotty Wenzel. He's a pine tree camper for years on end, and we've got not only this, but his mom has become an author sharing Scotty's story. So we see the book here, A Dog and His Boy. What is the significance here of the adventures of Spillway and Scotty? What does that mean to you? Well, we just wanted to show all the things that Scotty can do, even though he's differently abled. He goes skiing, he goes surfing, ride, horseback riding, and he goes to pine tree camp. And he's able to enjoy all the activities that they offer, and he's very social, so he loves to be around all the other campers. Now, Heidi, we're still doing the telethon here. Why is it important that people continue to call? So that we can provide opportunities for children that have disabilities and they have the opportunity to go out and try all of these amazing things that, have, that Scotty has learned to do. Kids just like Scotty, a dog and his boy. This is the book, and you can find that on Amazon, McSee Books, all sorts of places around Maine. Mm. Donate so that kids like Scotty can have the opportunity to experience summertime, wintertime, all seasons in Maine outdoors. That number's on your screen. There's also Venmo at Pine Tree Camp and online at pinetreesociety.org. So we'll be back here for one final check-in before the show's over. But for now, John and Brittany, we'll go back to you at the desk. Tom Krasnowski, thank you very much for that report. And don't forget the um, paddle for Pine Tree Camp is this weekend, Saturday and Sunday. Offers a way for people of all ages with disabilities to enjoy the Maine outdoors. Your donations support their tuition assistance initiative, where no camper is turned away based on their ability to pay. Campers say your support enables lifelong memories. My favorite part of the first two years was getting in the water, getting, overcoming my fear and getting comfortable in the water. Scotty's been going since I believe it was 2013 and it's just been incredible. He loves it. He's very social. He loves to be around all the other kids. He loves all the activities that they offer and he just has a blast when he's there. The camp is the most magical place on earth. Some people think you have to leave Maine to find the most ma magical place on earth, but you don't. You just have to go to Rome, Maine and find it. Country Camp rocks! The first Pine Tree Campers are scheduled to arrive on June 27th. Donations will be accepted all through June. You can continue to support at pinetreesociety.org or on Venmo at Pine Tree Camp. And check out on our website our video playlist of all of our live shots from today. It was a lot of fun. Now still to come, tennis semifinals rolled on today. Ben, sir.